Hi, my name is Martha. Welcome to Adulting with a Disability. I use NDIA manage, plan manage, self managed, or a bit of everything. Today I'm going to work through all the different management styles and how they work and what they allow you to do. Have you subscribed to my channel? If not, tap subscribe and the bell and you'll be notified of videos that come out. NDIA plans are the easiest to manage as you don't have to do anything on your part except find registered providers and they do the rest for you. But you're limited to just NDIA re registered providers. If you are plan managed, you can use registered and non-registered providers, providing their price is under the price guide. In order to be plan managed, you need to have a plan management provider that claims the money through the portal. You can either pay the provider yourself and then get reimbursed by your plan manager by putting in a receipt or you can put in an invoice with your plan manager and they will pay it for you. As a self-managed participant, you are totally responsible for your plan. You need to pay your providers and also claim it through the portal. You have two ways of doing this. You can put an invoice in and ask NDIS to provide you the money, which you then have to pay within seven days. Or you can pay it out of your own money and then claim a reimbursement from NDIS. Self-managed plans have other benefits that you can find in the self-management handbook. I will put a link in the description box. Some plans have a mixture of plan management, NDIA management and self-managed. And more often than not, a plan managed plan will have assistive technology that's NDIA managed. The benefit of having assistive technology that's NDIA managed is that you can call up a neighbour and they can help you with repairs really quickly and efficiently. Also, often consumables are part self-managed and part plan managed and this is good because you can buy what you need and claim it back through the portal yourself. I hope that this has been helpful. Leave me any questions you have and comments on the Facebook page which is linked in the description. My next NDIA post will go into the categories that you find in your plan.